everyone welcome back to my channel it's Tisha and today I'm going to bring you all uh, the candles I picked up the other day when they had a single wick sale um for $6.50 I believe let's see yeah $6.50 um I actually placed my order online that day but when I picked up the box yesterday uh it sounded like glass inside one accidentally got broke in transit and so they already have it on the way to me i should get it today which is crazy i think i live really close to a um bath and body works uh disbursement or whatever facility so that's cool so i'll get that today and it's actually a duplicate so i just figured i'd film this video but i opened everything already i have smelled everything so i have a little bit of notes to share and a couple of rewards so in total i picked up seven single wicks i use them and we have two bathrooms i have an office and i take one to my office um, my office is very small, like smaller than a bathroom, so nothing too overpowering for that. So I have plenty of uses for the single wick candles, and I thought this was a pretty decent price and a great way to try a few of the scents I was thinking about, and I haven't, we didn't know if we were going to get a sale. Actually, today there's 10 off sale, so of course I'll probably end up in the store at some point this weekend because I have a 20% off coupon that expires on the 28th, whatever day that is, I think two days from now. So I'll be need to be using that. And, um, but I, we, we weren't sure, we didn't know that as the day of the sale came. So I wanted to try a few of these. So we'll just get right into it. And I'm gonna start with the two rewards I redeemed. So I actually got a second one of these. It's the succulent uh, wallflower plug. I just find it so cute. And I like to have a few of these on hand that aren't the actual light up ones. This one does not light up. Um, or that I can see. No, I don't think it does. Um, and it's just really pretty and I think it will look so good for spring and summer. So I used a reward. It was $16.50. So I picked this up. I also really uh, was intrigued and the it's the packaging again. And uh, I wanted to get the coconut sunset uh, in the fine fragrance mist. And it was the packaging, but then also the notes are coconut blossom, sparkling bergamot, beach turb, tuberose, Hawaiian Minoy, and molten amber. And I sprayed this yesterday because like I said, there was glass, so I was very careful and I wasn't gonna open that on camera. And I sprayed this, and this is like a beautiful coconut mixed with the perfume and the two um, marry together so well. So this will be a very pretty summer scent. You know, when you get dressed up and you want something summery, but also perfume this is it. So I'm very happy to have this and I highly recommend if you like coconut, but a perfumey, sweet and light, um, the floral isn't too strong and uh, I just found this to be very pretty. And I don't think this is a new scent, so you might have already had it before, but I had never actually um, owned this one before. So excited to have that and I got it for free with a reward. Now on to what you came for, the candles. I picked up two of the uh, Easter candles. I grabbed a Somebody Loves You and it's just so cute. And like I said, this will look really cute um, in a bathroom or in my office for Easter or the month of. And uh, it's strawberry pound cake. And I don't typically have an issue with single wicks when I put them in a small space. So I can't really speak to how strong this will be, but um, I definitely will include it in a post burn review um, that I just started here. So I will keep you posted to let you know how that performed. And then I also had to get an online exclusive, You Crack Me Up, which was Marshmallow Fluff. And I like, I some of them I don't love when they do these little cute sayings, but these two are super cute and Easter. I don't, oh, it smells really good. It smells just like a marshmallow fluff uh, candle. I think the notes are like marshmallow and frosting and that's kind of what I'm, you know, getting the vibe on here. But um, yeah, like I was saying, some of these I don't, but for Easter I don't over decorate. So this will be just cute and the color's beautiful. So that'll look super cute somewhere for Easter. So I grabbed those and actually I had gotten a second you crack me up that broke but they've already sent me out a new one so we're all good here but since it was an online exclusive i went ahead and ordered two of those and then i got a few of the summer um single wicks that came out and i had not owned any of these previously so i did not know what i was getting um but i figured in a single wick and for the price it was something i would make use of or gift these are perfect little gifts to stick in you know away for 
someone's something comes up and you don't have anything. So um, I usually can always find a good use for these. But the first one is a Waikiki Beach Coconut. And this packaging's okay. I like the colors. I think they're really pretty for summer. I wish the notes were on the small ones. I get it though they're out of space. But this is very pretty. Um, it's got the beachy coconut smell. Um, I like it a lot. I, I already had this in a cream, so I kind of had a clue that I'd like that one. These next two, I was very uh, intrigued. I don't know why. I thought hibiscus waterfall. I had no idea what this would smell like. Mm, and it's uh, floral, and um, it's got like that um, a floral note, and I'm not quite else sure what is in there, but um, sometimes floral can get me a little choked up, which, but I think even if I wasn't burning this, it's super cute to just sit in a bathroom for summer. And, um, I don't know. Well, I'm going to keep you posted on this one, but I don't typically go for florals, but this one, I don't know if it was the color or the packaging. It just, it ended up in my cart. And then this one, I am probably going to say is my favorite of all the ones I grabbed, uh, mango Mai Tai. And um, this one was just recommended by a few people that I follow here on YouTube. And it's so good. I don't even know, it just smells so good. <laughs> Mango, it must be my jam. I, I get like a summer fruity drink note, but this one is good. So if you're uh, heading to a store or you have a redeem to reward, I don't think you can go wrong with that one. And then the next two, um, a few of you had recommended for me and I appreciate it so much. I live with a couple of boys and they've been asking, can we get some boy candles? Can we get some boy scents? Everything around here smells so fruity and girly. Um, so I got a mahogany teakwood and I don't know why, but I've never smelled this before that I can remember, which I know this is very popular from Bath and Works, so I don't know how I've missed it, but um, it smells amazing. Like it smells like a, a man, <laughs> but like a good, you know, the good smell of a man. So I'm gonna stick this in the bathroom and I know um, I, I know I got a good one for that. So thank you to whoever recommended this. I do like it and I'm okay with boy smell. So they can, they can win this one. I'll get a couple of boy smelling candles. And the other one I was intrigued by, and someone had said that this one too had kind of smelled, um, you know, like a men's cologne is the sea salt therapy mimosa spearmint. And I think this one is also an online exclusive, but I just got one because I just wanted to see what it would smell like. And I do get that. There's definitely more of like an apothecary aroma, you know, aromatherapy to this, but I do also get a little bit of a men's cologne smell in here as well. So, <coughs> excuse me, hope I can edit that out. I think that hibiscus waterfall's got me, guys. Like I said, I like floral smells, but a lot of times they'll choke me up. But so that is, woo, the sea salt. Uh, therapy mimosa spearmint and I actually recommend this one it smells really good I'm gonna stick this one in the bathroom too so um I will include these in a post for a review and let you know how all these performed but that is actually it that's all I grabbed from the single wick sale I do I did um participate I love when Cynthia said it and I I've noticed that I say it too I did participate in the soap sale especially when they threw in that free wall flower plug and free shipping so that should be coming today and I'll get that film for you guys and get it up. And also, um, I just decided I'm gonna head toward the store this weekend and use up my coupons. I let them go all this time and I feel like that's really impossible to do. So I was waiting for a candle sale and I do have a few more on my list I wanna grab. So if I get that, I will get that filmed and up for you guys this weekend as well. Um, so I hope you liked this video. If you did, I hope you consider subscribing. Comment down below if you got any of these candles um, during the sale or if you're interested in any of these. And um, I will see you in another video very, very soon. Thank you everybody so much for watching. I appreciate each and every one of you. Bye.